Prosthetic legs have come a long way, offering amputees a new lease on life. But they're often one size fits all and not very stylish. And I was always amazed that it never looked like the kind of sculpture I thought it should. That they looked very utilitarian, like they came from engineers. And they, they solved the mechanical function very well, but they didn't really dress the human part of the equation. So designer Scott Summit came up with a new type of cover for prosthetic legs called fairings. Recreating a unique leg shape by scanning a client's existing leg, the fairings are then built using a 3D printer. They not only return the lost contour of the body, but also allow for individual design and style using different patterns and graphics. Initially, I was amazed at what they could do here. Chad Crittenden lost a leg to cancer. He was recruited to advise the company after being spotted as a contestant on the TV show Survivor. And I wasn't overly concerned with getting my shape back, as it were. I was fine with who I was and my post. But once we put this thing on, it wasn't conscious, but it was sort of, there's something there that I felt um, flipped a switch and it, I felt more complete, and I felt that my shape was back. The technology may eventually make these kinds of prosthetics more accessible in more parts of the world. This might be a way to create legs for developing countries at some point, where you could simply take an iPad, scan somebody, solve their geometry in the cloud, and then print a leg for them and have them walking soon after. That's possible. The fairings are made with a strong, lightweight polymer that's more affordable than traditional coverings, and dishwasher safe. Haven Daily, Associated Press, San Francisco.